What is up everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Ford Era. And uh, today, as you guys see with the title, we are getting the 76 all polished up. My boy Danny just got here and uh, brought the 76 over to the shop. So that way we can make uh, this paint not so dull and oxidized. So you guys can see how chalky it all is. Danny's going to be knocking out the interior, which is actually already pretty shiny, but he's going to go back over all of the interior surfaces and uh, then he's going to knock out the entire outside. We got some sweet patina for the hood since the hood is uh, down to bare metal and still got some color, but yeah, so as you guys can see, the truck has already been uh, kept really well. It's got a, like a sheen to it, but it's just very oxidized and chalky. As you guys can see, it's gonna color right out real good. So, uh, where is he at? Danny! Yep. Yo! What's up? All right, so I was telling them, but you wanna tell them what you're doing? Yeah, so starting off with the hood, before we polish the whole vehicle, we're gonna do, well, I already hit it with the first round of, the, of uh, sanding it down, knocked down all the rust, and for now, we're gonna protect it with just some sweet patina sauce. And then from there, everything, all this beautiful blue, all this heavy blue, we're gonna wash it down, decontaminate everything, and do a few steps of paint correction and really make her shine up. Oh yeah. And uh, gonna pretty much get this thing on a tripod and try to get you guys as much just uh, time-lapse B-roll, so enjoy. All right guys, so my boy Danny got her looking good. He did a uh, full cleanup on it and then uh, he used the magic eraser. So you get a lot of the chalkiness out. And then now we uh, pushed it into the shop with Goldust as you guys saw. And uh, he's gonna go to town and start buffing. So this is the before. You can see she's all dull but clean.
right guys so look how good this turned out Danny absolutely killed it so uh, he did a full three stage buff this thing is so shiny and straight and then on the inside he buffed all the painted surfaces so that way it's perfect this thing is so awesome I'm so happy with the way it turned out I mean little, he literally buffed everything this truck looks so good I left the tailgate so I still got to go get that and uh, there's the other side I am so happy with how this turned out so some of you guys are probably wondering what's the plan with this truck I don't really know I'm thinking that you know I need to finish uh, doing like a couple little mechanical things on it just to get the 390 back up and running and uh, then I'm probably just gonna drive it like this for a little bit um, I want to upgrade the interior so probably do the Dakota gauges some you know probably TMI bench seat redo the headliner probably redo the AC system since it's not working get like the vintage air in there but uh it's a really awesome rig. I can't believe how solid and straight and clean this thing is. I love it. But we're going to end this video here. So as always, if you guys can, smash the like button. In the comment section below, let me know what do you guys think we should do to this motor-wise? What kind? Should we do a gas, a diesel, Godzilla, maybe a power stroke? I'm not sure. Um, so yeah. And uh, as always, we'll see you in the next video. Later. Later.